So the issue that we might actually have here is the fuel from that thing might actually try and get into our helicopter. And if it gets into our helicopter, our helicopter will fall from the sky. The- No! It's happened! Guys, no! <laughs> Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks build and rescue video. Today we are actually checking out this thing right here called the Omni OH-22 Medium Utility Helicopter. So, that was a mouthful, but anyway, we're going to jump inside this thing and we're going to take off. And we are actually going to do an actual search and rescue mission. Uh, so, we're going to have to fly all the way out to this guy. Uh, there are enemy AI still on, so we could get shot at as we pass the fishing village. Um, but yeah, this is going to be interesting. So transport a blue boat in the ocean to Komodo Terminal. Okay, this is going to be tricky because we're on a helicopter, but we'll see if we can do it. Okie dokie, so let's jump inside in the other seat. There we go, because this is the pilot seat, and let's get this thing ready. So, uh, we get our strobe lights. Wait, how do I turn on the battery? Engine, master, avionics, throttle, idle flight. What the heck? All right, these guys, yes. Uh, cabin lights, there we go. And we are pretty much ready to go. All right, nice. Uh, I'm not controlling the weather all the time at all, so that is all just random. Uh, and that's A-OK. -okay. Can I lift up the landing gear? Yes, I can. That's pretty sick. All right, cool. And then we're going to go ahead and put in our thingamabobby into here. There we go. And hopefully we can just go there. How do I turn that on? <laughs> how, do we, how do we turn the autopilot on? I'm not sure. I don't know how that works. Wait, is that this? I, I don't know if that's this. Uh, so altitude, yes, we can keep that. And then if I press this, what happens? And then, and then this as well. And then, I, I don't, <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Guys, I don't, whoa, <laughs> oh God. Okay, right. I, I, where's it going? Where are you going? Oh, no, no, that doesn't seem right. Okay, waypoint. Activated. Okay, there we go. Alright, this is a lot more interesting. So instead of using buttons, they use a monitor. That is kind of crazy, but it works. Okay, very good. You just gotta get used to it, that's all. Good. Okie dokie, so it is gonna be our mission to actually rescue a boat. Now, we are using a medium helicopter, a medium utility helicopter, uh, but it does have jet engines powering it, so I'm assuming uh, that this thing will be powerful enough to actually make it work, which is awesome. That's really, really good. Uh, we have these big old doors in case we need to rescue some people. Uh, we have an extra, what, two seats right there in the front. Uh, we have another seat, another seat, and another three at the back. So we've got five, seven, uh, eight. We've actually got eight because of the co-pilot seat. Awesome. Uh, so I'm actually thinking that what we'll actually have to use is our refueling thing, <laughs> which is really weird. We might have to pick up a, uh, a vehicle using our refueling thing, uh, unless you guys can see any rope anchors. But I do not see any rope anchors anywhere, so uh, this is going to be interesting. We'll see if it works. Okie dokie, so if you guys have made it to this point in the video and you guys haven't liked the video already, please consider liking the video, it helps me out a lot. Also, I do actually have my Discord link down below, so if you guys want to chat and stuff, my Discord is linked down there and you guys can join it if you want to. Is that an enemy boat? Is it an enemy boat? No, it's not. Um, so yeah, those are linked down below if you guys want to check them out, and that's, that's it, that's awesome. Cool, anyway, let's continue on. Look at that thing, yeah, woo! Nice, that actually is a really, really cool looking ship, but um, we're not dealing with that today. We might have to deal with some enemy patrol vessels, or maybe even some enemy warships, uh, but I don't think it's going to be quite that bad. I think we'll be alright. Oh, we got another vessel on our left side. What is that over there? What are you? That is a tanker. That's kind of interesting too. Nice. Yeah, that looks really, really cool. Uh, but no, we're going to continue on until we reach this guy right out here. Uh, I don't know whether we're going to have to transport people or not. That's going to be kind of like um, maybe an issue, maybe not an issue. We'll see uh, if we can actually land next to it or not. Uh, because this autopilot system, I still haven't really figured out what it is. This is, this is our altitude right here, right? That's our uh, waypoint. That's a W, not a H. Um, yeah, so I guess we can just lower this altitude down. 
uh, until we are pretty much sitting on the water, and then we should be good. Maybe. Okie dokie, it should be coming into sight very, 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 very soon. Uh, and what is it? It is a blue boat. Okay, we are looking for a blue boat in a blue ocean. Let's go. All right, and then the enemy base is actually over there, so we should be good. We should be good. Uh, right, where is it? Come on. It needs to pop in very soon. It should be here, somewhere. I don't see it. Does anyone? Does anyone see it? Oh. There's lightning as well. If the lightning hits us, uh, we're, we're dead. <laughs> if the lightning hits us, we're gonna die, but that's all right. All right, here we go. We're going in, we are almost at it. Oh, there it is. There it is right there. It is a little boat. It's tiny. All right, okay. We might be able to lift this one. Possibly. If not, we'll just rescue the people from it. Oh, the helicopter is automatically, like, leveling itself out. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's go ahead and turn this off. Sorry, turn this off. Turn this off and go. All right, here we go. We're going to lower ourselves down as well. We really, really, really do not want to get hit by the, uh, by the lightning. All right, here we go. There's the blue boat. Okay, so... Uh, is there anyone on board? I don't see anyone. I don't actually see anyone on board. Okay, hopefully it's got a refueling thing somewhere. It's gonna be tricky, because the waves are really bobbing that thing around. Alright, but we're gonna lower ourselves down to about here. There we go. So we can somewhat get back in. That seems like a good idea. Open up the door. Oh god. Oh god, this is gonna be tricky. Alright, open up all the doors, uh, just in case, and that'll be great. Alright, give give me the hose. Good. I'm gonna jump off. We've jumped out of our helicopter. We are now going over to the vessel. Okay. We need to get in the vessel. Here we go. Yes, and we need to find the refueling bit. I'm stuck in the room. <laughs> I'm stuck! No! I'm stuck in the Oh, there we go. Uh, I don't know where the refueling bit is on this ship. There might not be one. I mean, that would be an issue. If there's no refueling bit, then then we don't know. We have nowhere to attach to. Oh, that's silly. Surely there's a refueling thing. Really? I don't think there is. Oh, no. I don't think we're able to actually lift this thing because there's no re... That sucks. That's super annoying. Oh, no, guys. There is. There is. There is. There's one right here. So the issue that we might actually have here is the fuel from that thing might actually try and get into our helicopter. And if it gets into our helicopter, our helicopter will fall from the sky. Uh, and unfortunately, I can't seem to swim over to my helicopter while I've got this in my hand. Oh, now I can. Okay, cool. Uh, right. Ah, we're so close. We are so, so close. All right, attach it. That's an electrical cable. Where's the refueling one? Oh, God. Now the helicopter doesn't have... Where, <laughs> Where do we refuel it from? What in the world? All right, do you have an electrical connector on you? You don't, do you? It doesn't have one. It doesn't... It doesn't have one. Surely our helicopter has one somewhere, though. Also, these waves are getting a bit out of hand. These waves are getting very out of hand. Right, I need to find it. I need to find it. Where do we refuel our helicopter from? Please tell me. All right, close this door just in case it's on the back. It might be on the side. There it is. All right, yes, it is on the side. Okay, so we're going to grab... We're not going to grab that. We're going to grab it on the boat again. We're going to swim back over. And we got this. Guys, the whole fact that this boat is like literally bobbing so much it goes underwater is scary. And our helicopter is getting pretty close to the water too. Okay, we need to do. We need to be quick about this. Also, I have no idea whether this helicopter will lift it, but we'll try. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Get closer. Get closer. I might drown in this whole situation. There might be some drowning happening. Come on! Come on! Yes! Alright, the helicopter's getting very close to the waves now. Go pilot seat, there we go, close the door. Uh, close this door at the back, they're both closed. The... The... No! It's happened! Guys, no! <laughs> oh, that's so sad. That is so, so sad. Okay, so what happened there? Oh god, I'm drowning now. We are drowning now. This was a, such a failed rescue attempt. And the boat is now upside down as well. Oh god, let me get up to the surface. Oh jeez louise, guys. That is so annoying. 
That is so super duper annoying. So what happened was the fuel from inside the boat managed to travel up the hose <laughs> somehow uh, and got into our helicopter without being pumped. All right, remember that without being pumped, and and now and now our helicopter has sank. <laughs> All right, well, that's not good. That's, that's really bad. I do have another helicopter that might be able to lift both of these, though. So let's go get that, and we'll see if we can do the mission with that. All right, guys, we have the helicopter for the job now. This thing right here is a Chinook. Well, it's not really a Chinook, but it is designed around the Chinook, I would say. Uh, and it is actually called the Omni OH-60 Heavy Lift Helicopter. So uh, as it is a heavy lift helicopter, I would assume that this thing would actually be able to pick up both our helicopter and that boat at the same time. Now, I could be reaching there, but at the same time, maybe I'm not. <laughs> we'll see if it works. We will. We'll see if it works. I do actually want to say as well, though, that the whole system on the inside is actually the same as the other helicopter, which is very good uh, when you are designing a company thing. So, like, this is a company helicopter, uh, and there you go. Right, okay, so it is getting dark now as well. We are going to lift ourselves into the sky. Remember, the enemy base is right in front of me. Uh, so that's kind of crazy. Uh, we got to get to the waypoint, so let's go ahead and whack it into here. Uh, why can't I? Oh, because I didn't have a waypoint selected. There we go. Right, good. Altitude hold on. Waypoint. Go. All right, is it working? I think it's working. Nice. All right, cool. So we're going to get over there, and we're actually going to go ahead and attach ourselves to the vessel and not our helicopter, and then we're going to take off like that. Okie dokie, so just because I want you like I want you guys to actually see what's going on uh, I've actually gone ahead and made it a little bit lighter outside I'm not controlling the weather at all and that is why our helicopter is flying sort of sideways <laughs> It is it's flying sideways. Uh, this is gonna be a tricky rescue. It is because the boat is actually upside down now um, The waves are probably gonna be quite high. Let's have a little look Yeah, the waves are gonna be quite high uh, and there is only me doing the job, so I am the pilot, I am the engineer, I, I'm, I'm all of the jobs that we need for this. So we're going to go ahead and try and see if this will work, uh, and hopefully it will. We'll see though. I suppose we should actually have a look in the back of this thing as well. Uh, what we do actually have is uh, some winches down here in the floor, so we'll actually be able to lift things up and down that are underneath us. Uh, we also have a little med bed right there, we also have some seating. Uh, we have a cargo bay, so you can actually load the cargo into this. Uh, and there is special cargo for this for this helicopter. Um, and then we've also got this winch right here where you can drag things in, which would be awesome too. But I think we'll actually attach a parachute to ourselves. Diving equipment could be very useful, but we're not going to do that. Uh, and we can actually attach this uh, to this winch, presumably, and that would work. But where do we control the winches from? Here, presumably. Yeah, overhead winch. Oh, we can totally make that work. That's cool. Yeah. And then we can attach to the boat using this thing, or we can attach the boat using this thing, or even that thing, or that thing. Yeah, alright, cool. Well, anyway, we're almost there, so we're going to probably go down and uh, attach on, and then fly away. I'm sure it'll be fine. However, the mission has changed a little tiny bit. So the mission has gone from rescuing the whole boat all the way to the, uh, the island, all the way over here. Uh, it's gone to actually just dragging it to the, uh, the coastline. So that is what we need to do, if we can. All right, turn this off. All right, cool. Go ahead and make ourselves descend. Here we go. We're going to go down. Hopefully the helicopter hasn't sank the boat. Because it might have sank the boat and that would suck. Because I don't know how I'm supposed to do anything at that point. But Oh my golly gosh. All right, how in the world does this work? All right, we might have to do something special here. Like, very, very special. Okay, right, let's get this ready. So this is going to detach. It's going to go on there. We're going to send this backwards. All right, we're going to drop it out the hole. No! <laughs> no! No! I need that. Oh, no. Okay, well, that's ruined my chances of doing that. That's annoying. Did it have an electrical connector on it? I feel like it might have. Alright, attach that onto there. Disconnect this. Throw this down the hole. No, we did it again! Oh! No! <laughs> oh my golly gosh. Alright, 
grab this. There, push it. Just push it. It's, it's way easier. Push it out. Push it out. Go. There we go. All right, cool. And that is a stronger connector anyway, so that's fine. All right, take this back to the middle of the aircraft. All right, and then winch down. All right, fine. Fine. This might work. It might not work. We'll see. All right, so we got to get over to the boat. Oh, my. Holy. Why is it so strongly, like... When it goes forwards, it goes forwards. Jeez Louise. All right, hold on. No, stop revving so much to go forwards. It's weird. All right, okay. So we need to essentially put this on the front of the boat. Oh, my God. Right, okay. We need to, we need to somehow make this work. I'm not sure how this is going to work. I have no idea how this is going to work, guys. I'm struggling. Okay. Uh, it'd be easier if there was someone down there holding on to the connector, but there isn't. Oh, God. Oh, God. Trying to save someone in waves like this is insane. These waves are crazy. Oh. Oh. Oh, no, I can't do it. I can't do it. Holy bums. Holy bums. I genuinely can't get it in the right place. Because these waves are literally like as tall as the boat is. I don't even know if it has a connector. We need to see. I, I can't, right, okay, let's check. Let's check if it has a connector first before we do anything else. I, I can't see it. <laughs> I can't see if it has a connector. Alright, backwards. Backwards and sideways. Oh, lordy. Oh. Oh, that would have been close. That would have been very close. Okay. No, right, let's check. Let's just check using this. Does it have a connector on the front? Yes, it does. We need to connect to this thing, if we can. But, like, look at us. This is impossible. Wait, the waves are actually dying down a little bit. It's not bouncing around quite as much as it was. All right, okay, let's turn ourselves around. Here we go. We'll fly towards the right, which is where it's going for some reason. I could try and tip it over. I could. All right, yeah, the waves are definitely dying down. That was close. That was extremely close. Are we on? No. All right, come on. Come on, we gotta be, we gotta be so precise with this. Maybe? I think we're connected. I think we're connected. All right, okay, let's turn this waypoint up and we'll see if we can lift this. Oh, guys, we got this. All right, okay, so can we actually lift this out of the water? That is the question. I think we can. There we go. But then, <laughs> but then, can we lift our helicopter as well? Oh, my. This is a heavy lifter, isn't it? Jeez Louise. All right, okay, so to make it a little bit easier on the helicopter that we're in, we're actually going to go ahead and lift up uh, the wires. So we're going to winch up the overhead cable uh, so that the boat is closer to our helicopter essentially. The closer it is, the easier it is to uh, to handle. Alright, it's up here. Alright, good. Guys, we're doing it. We're doing it! Nice! Alright, cool. Let's go. So, we'll put our new waypoint in, which is just going to be the islands. There we go. Set as waypoint. Uh, go ahead and put it into Kia. Very good. Go ahead and do this. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> what? 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 What just happened? Excuse me? Excuse me, what happened? What happened? Where's my helicopter? Uh, what? Uh, I'm sorry, but what is this? What? 
What is happening? Guys, what is my helicopter doing? Oh my, that's the cables. What in the world? All right, okay, so turning the autopilot on while tugging both a helicopter and a boat is a bad idea in this in this helicopter. All right, well, anyway, um, I think we'll end the video here. We've, we've made our point. We've done our point. Uh, and that was that this helicopter... Wait, is that the boat over there? There's the boat still. Uh, the point is that this helicopter is actually strong enough to lift a boat and a helicopter. Uh, putting fuel from the wrong helicopter into... Sorry, the wrong fuel into a helicopter makes the helicopter fall. Uh, and, yeah, that's what we learned today. So, uh, make sure you remember that, guys. What is happening to that? <laughs> What's going on with this thing? That ain't it. That's not right. Guys, this is not right. What the heck? What is it connected to? It's not, it's not connected to anything. That's so weird. That's really weird. All right, well, anyway, uh, I enjoy doing vis uh, vi visions? videos uh, of these missions. They're actually really, really cool. Uh, so if you guys want to see more of this, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see what I can do. Also, my screen's just turned black, so that's the thing. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.